three years on YouTube. When I never feel bad, feel bad, come on, yeah. And because I started this channel on my birthday, it's also my birthday. So yay! I'm a kid at heart, so birthdays, anniversaries, moments like these are important to me. And I like highlighting them even if it's something as simple as a happy anniversary, bun fight, or even a congratulations for surviving another solar revolution. In three years, I don't think I have created something groundbreaking. There are a bunch of channels comparable to mine that are far more successful and potentially more lucrative than mine. But I've said it before, and I'm gonna say it again. This is not my first job. I teach for a living, which is sometimes comparable to, you know, herding cats. And I don't know much about cat wrangling, but it, yeah, it's a challenge sometimes. Am I happy with what I have accomplished so far? Yes. Did I cover content that I originally had in mind when I started it? No, man, yeah. It depends. I tried different things, but ultimately I think what works best for me is just being truthful, authentic, and honest, and just talking from the heart. Like apparently, one of my most viewed videos was one about my French immersion unit. Once again, not groundbreaking. It's a unit on, on music and having students share their, their musical preferences. How it ended up being one of my most viewed videos is beyond me. Another one is a video that I filmed about a year almost two years ago where I announced that I was changing schools that too I have no idea why it ended up being one of my most viewed videos but I think it's because I spoke from the heart I think for me being creative on this channel means finding different ways to connect with others which is why I am going to continue this format don't expect any sketch comedy from me. It's not my thing. Don't expect anything revolutionary, groundbreaking. As I often say during some of my conferences, I didn't invent the spaghetti sauce. I just added my own flavor to it. So whether it's sharing stories about um, my, my teaching life, my educator life, or just life in general, I'm just adding my own flavor. And I have to admit, I kind of stole that idea from a former student of mine, shout out to Steve, who, who basically <laughs> compared student life to a big spice rack and, you know, we need all the spice we can get or something to that effect. So if you have been a viewer from the start, from the get-go, thank you for sticking with me. Thank you for watching some of the more meh videos. And, and to those who kind of stumble upon my channel by accident or because you have nothing else to do, thank you. Thank you for liking, thank you for subscribing, thank you for sharing, uh, it's, it's appreciated. And uh, happy anniversary to me and my three years on YouTube. On that lovely note, folks, have yourselves a lovely day. As I often say during conferences, my God, the birds are loud today.